Well guys, it's been a super busy day today. Didn't have a whole lot of time to record. We were processing turkeys. We were live over on Instagram today. Had to go make deliveries. Had to pick up some groceries. Had to pick up some scratch greens because we are trying to uh, up the uh, vitamin, mineral, and protein content of the current grain we have. Plus it's a nice little source when it's cooling down like this and these chickens are kind of going through a molt. It's good to give them some sort of supplement to help them. And again, no corn, no soy. It's the same uh, same grain provider we usually use. So it's good stuff, good quality stuff. But we need to feed these chickens, feed these turkeys. Nick's going up to feed the dogs. I had to pick up dog food too. Going up to feed the dogs, feed the goats. And uh, yeah, see, we still got our turkey process and stuff all set up. Got that done today. We got six done. I think we have somewhere around 25 left. But yeah, good stuff. And then, what else? Got to take our compost stuff up, get it in the compost pile, get the four-wheeler all moved. But first, let's get these layers fed so they'll leave me alone. You got a what? Oh, so one of our uh, one of our layers started laying again. That's a plus. Oh, good. You filled the water. All right, let's get these chickens fed. Easton and Maddie are feeding the rabbits. It's cold, guys. You notice I got my hoodie up. It's cold. I think it's going to freeze again tonight. I need to get this four-wheeler put away. Get the trailer taken off it. I don't think we're butchering anything tomorrow. We are going to butcher more chickens on Thursday, though. All right, let's get these turkeys fed. Why well, did come up and help Nick? Because something's going on with the brakes on the tractor. Don't have any. These dogs... Keep tipping over their water. Ah, as soon as we fill it, they're grabbing it, and just carrying it around completely full and tipping it over. So that's all right. We're going to be moving them off this hill here in the next week, getting them in the garden, mixing the does with the bucks. So we shouldn't have to worry about this too much longer. Woo! Let's go. Windy. Girls want some dinner. Whoa! Yep, got stuck in the fence. Dang it. Okay, here he goes. Here we go. Not for you, River. We lost. Hey. Hey, one at a time. One at a time. One at a time. Only one can fit at a time. All right, you feeling it? Yeah. Here, hand me the hose, I'll fill it. Chicken's good? Uh, not yet. Whoa! Holy crap! Do they have enough water? Or you haven't done them yet? I don't know. Okay. okay. Here I am freezing, and this kid's in freaking shorts on a short sleeve shirt. I don't get it. Maybe that just means I'm getting old. All right, got the last bit of stuff added to the compost pile. Got this cleaned up a little bit. Now we're gonna go give the turkeys some more food. Maddie fed him a <clears throat> black bucket, which is about 20, 25 pounds of grain full. So they need about, right now, with all these turkeys and it's getting cold, so they need to stay warm, but they probably eat 50 pounds. Yeah. I eat a, a total of like 60 or 70 pounds a day. Quite a bit. Turkey, turkey. Turkey, turkey. Yeah, you guys are still hungry. I know. No. I'm going to step on the fence and lock it down. Okay. There we go. Next eater. So our plan. I believe our plan was today, butcher these turkeys, you know, we butcher five or six, and we did. And then we were supposed to uh, take the remaining, pull out the tomato plants, and uh, put them in the garden, and let them clean stuff up. Well, I guess we were more ambitious on paper than <laughs> what we were actually able to get done in one day, because we got the turkeys done, made our deliveries, and that literally 
took up until well right when i got home so not enough time in one day unfortunately to get everything we wanted to get done but is what is and on that note we need to go make sure the uh, nesting boxes are closed but after that we're done go inside and have some dinner somebody broke my bird who was it was it you was it you it's probably the kids definitely tell that these girls are molten and the, the weather has changed because they went from 60 or 70 eggs last week and now we got like 30 today so there you go all right that's it short vlog today but we ran out of time it's time to go in and have dinner relax go to bed be ready for tomorrow what do you got going on hey <laughs> <laughs> i'm making tacos tacos she just got done cutting up how many chickens did you cut up oh, i think eight eight yeah mm, fun. i split them up and i froze them into legs and thighs and wings and i kept the breasts for dinner tomorrow oh cool you froze them uh yes probably much easier than canning them yeah I and like i said we just kind of ran out of time for the day so it is what it is See you in the next one, guys.